Okay, hi, I'm Crazy Chris, and welcome to So Cool Science. Science you can do right at home. I'm just checking out this wicked cool holographic technology and going over today's science file. And today's science file, it says, could scientists predict the future? Well, that's an awesome question. Try this. Welcome to the 22nd century. I'm the hologram known as Chris, and today's futuristic science file is interactive because I am going to present to you four technologies that could become a reality. Your job is to spot the one technology that couldn't possibly become a scientific reality. So let's get started. Let's say you're hungry and you don't want to wait for food. Well, you're in luck because the food generator will generate any food you want. Let's say that you want to sit down, but a chair is too far away. Well, you're in luck. All you have to do is telekinetically bring the chair to you. Want to head to the moon, but don't want to take the long flight? Well, you're in luck. The teleporter will transport you from wherever you are directly to where you want to be. Let's say you had a hard day at work, and you want to relax at the beach. Well, you're in luck because your home can transform into anything you want it to be. So, did you spot the one that couldn't possibly become a reality? Well, the answer is, take a closer look at this. The food generator is absolutely possible. This is because tests were conducted in 2007 using 3D printers, which took food paste and printed them in exactly the pattern that was entered into the computer. Given enough time for people to perfect these machines, they will eventually be able to generate any food imaginable. Shape-shifting the inside of your home is another absolute possibility. Programmable matter, or shape-shifting robotics, started in 2002. These so-called CADMs are tiny programmable robots that can communicate with other tiny robots. This technology will eventually be able to form any object, as well as shape-shift the inside of people's homes. You might think that telekinetics was the one that couldn't possibly come true. However, in 2004, an experiment was done on a paralyzed person who had a chip implanted in his brain. This chip was hooked up to a computer via a wire. He was able to control the mouse on the screen just by thinking about it. This technology can lead to people being able to move things just by thinking about them. The brain chip will send out a wave to the computer on the object and the object will move. Teleportation is the one that is unscientifically possible. Some people point to a light teleportation experiment done in Australia as evidence of this technology. However, this was not teleportation, but instead replication. It is possible to scan information and then replicate this information somewhere else. But this is not teleportation. This means that all you really would be doing is scanning your own information and replicating information somewhere else. So now you know there's no such thing as teleportation. You know, predicting future gadgets is why science is so cool.